think we are. No, that's it. Nice. Yeah, I had like for two years after I finished my university, like it's filled with Canadians. <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's one of the things that. Hello. Uh, I'm going for Berta first. Uh, tell me what's going on, old man. Oh, look there! Something strange and sinister has suddenly appeared. Oh, it fills me with dread. I think it's best I try to ignore it. So yeah, I had like time oh, uh, to migrate to, to, to Canada or uh, Australia, but I just didn't. I just like decided to stay for some reason. But still, like everything is open. Maybe after COVID. I mean, way after COVID. Because right now it's probably harder to do. There's another house here. And thank you. Nice. So, okay. one more. The Great Prince. Having heavy breaths flash from the ex exertion of battle. The figure emerged from the wall. Triumph was his and trophy he bore to prove it. The fearsome skull of his vanquished opponent. Startling warning he brought to the village, one that rang so true. Their wise savior, though a hero by the box, was a vicious beast, and this shrouded great prince was in truth the heroes deserved. With honor and humility, he recounted his quest below, his epic journey of one purpose, to find her, to protect her, his grey maiden, his partner in darkness. This guy? <laughs> Great prince, so dark, so troubled. What? But that's not the only danger I had to overcome in my quest for glory. You've noticed this trophy, haven't you? A keepsake from my final triumphant battle deep in the pit below us. Yes, my thunder. Claimed another victim and the crowd erupted into a static cheering. Cheering that was both loud and utterly sincere. To what do I owe my long string of triumphs and victories, you ask? As I said earlier, the key is in my personal philosophy. The 57 per precepts of Zod. Particularly relevant here is the first precept. Always win your battles. As for the other 56 percep percepts, well, well what? Oh, <laughs> they never let them laugh at you. Fools laugh at everything, even at their superiors. But beware, laughter isn't harmless. Laughter spreads like a disease, and soon everyone is laughing at you. You need to strike at the source of this preserved merriment quickly to stop it from spreading merriment. Oh, that's a new word. Precept 3. I, I'm not sure if I want to read all 60 something. Always be rested. Fighting adventuring takes your toll on your body. When you rest, your body strengths and repairs itself. The longer you rest, the stronger you become. Precept 4. Forget your past. The past is painful and thinking about your past can only bring you misery. Think about something else instead, such as the future or some food. Five. A strength beats strength. Is your opponent strong? No matter. Simply overcome their strength with even more strength, and they will soon be defeated. Six. Choose your own fate. Our elders teach that our fate is chosen for us before we are even born. I disagree. Hmm? Seven. Mourn out the dead. When we die, do things get better for us or worse? There's no way to tell, so we shouldn't bother mourning or celebrating for the matter. I travel alone. You can rely on nobody, and nobody will always be loyal. Therefore, nobody should be your constant companion. 9. Keep your home tidy. Your home is where you keep your most prized possession, yourself. Therefore, you should make an effort to keep it nice and clean. 
Pants, keep your Jump. weapon sharp. Don't make sure that my weapon lavender is kept well sharp at all times. This makes it much easier. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the mother will always betray you. Is there any uh, reward for listening to all of this? <laughs> So this is like, is there any politician here? <laughs> this guy, he kinda is. Mother's role will betray you. This person is on itself. Um, keep your cloak dirty. If your cloak gets wet, dry as, as soon as you can. Wearing wet clothes is unpleasant and can lead to illness. Never be afraid. Fear can only hold you back. Facing your fears can be tremendous effort. Therefore, you should just not be afraid in the first place. Respect your superiors. Wasn't there was something? Like saying a positive one? So many super superior. Uh, okay. One fall, one blow. Don't hesitate. Looking for like something interesting. Believe in your strength, of course. Seek trough in the darkness. Yeah, they are, but like, this is gonna take a while. If you try, succeed. If you're going to attempt something, make sure you achieve it. If you do not succeed, then you have actually failed. <laughs> Smart. Avoid this on all costs. Speak only the truth. When speaking to someone, it is courteous, uh, courteous and also efficient to speak truthfully. Be aware though that speaking truthfully may, may make your enemies. This is something you will have to bear. Be aware of your surroundings. Don't just walk along staring at the ground. You need to look up so every often to make sure nothing takes you by surprise. Yeah, just remember whenever we find him in some kind of trouble. Abandon the nest. As soon as you can, as you could, I left my as soon as I could, I left my birthplace and made my way out into the world. Do not linger in the nest. Identify the false weak points. Strike the false weak points. Protect your own weak point. Never have a weak point. Papanada. Don't trust your reflection. When peering at certain shining surfaces, you might see a copy of your own face. The face will mimic your movements and seem similar to your own, but I don't think it can be trusted. I actually found my mimic. That's another story. Eat as much as you can. When having a meal, add eat as much as you can, possibly can. This gives you an extra energy and means you can eat less frequently. Um, yeah. Don't peer into the darkness. If you peer into the darkness and can't see anything for too long, your mind will start to linger over old memories. Memories are to be avoided as per Percept 4. I would need to at least like, go back to per Percept 4. Develop your sense of direction. Okay. Having a good sense of direction is ha like having a magical map inside of your thought. Never accept a promise. Disease, live, disease lives inside of dirt. Uh, names have power. Names have power, and so to name something is to grant it power. I myself named my nail Lifehander. Do not steal the name. I won't. Show the name in no respect. Show the name in no respect. Yeah. Don't Im immediately before sleeping. Diet tips? Up is up, dab. <laughs> up is up, down is down. If you fall over in the darkness, it can be easy to lose your bearing and forget which way is up. Keep this precept in mind. Eggshells and brittle. Once again, this precept explains itself. Borrow, but do not lend. If you lend and are repaid, you gain nothing. If you borrow, but do not repay, you gain everything. That's a smart guy. Uh, not true. Uh, beware the mysterious force. The mysterious force bears, bears down on us from above, pushing us downwards. If you spend too long in the air, the force will crush you against the ground and destroy you. Beware. 
Gravity. Nobody likes you. Eat quickly and drink slowly. Your body is delicating and you must fuel it with great deliber deliberation. But food must go in and as fast as possible. Foods are as slow like. His voice actor did a lot of work. Yeah. <laughs> Bobbing around. And we're getting a bubble tea. And the green troop DLC also contains something that will help with your fragile charms. Try bringing fragile strength into the small tent. That's the most important one. Yeah, I'm having like a lot, all of them right now. That means we're gonna. Yeah, nice. Nice. Obey no law but your own. Mm. Let's learn to detect lies. Oh, when others speak, they usually lie. Scrutinize and question them relentlessly until they reveal their they say. Spend Geo when you have it. But I don't have it. I mean, I have a Geo, but I don't have anything. Never forget, I don't have anything to spend on. You cannot breathe water. Why do you even listen to that guy? Weather is refreshing, but if you try to breathe it, you are in for a nasty show. It's like, to walk, use your legs. To watch, use your eyes. Do not breath the water. <laughs> breath the air. Breath, lose your nose. One thing is not another. One thing is not another. This one should be obvious, but I've had others try to argue that one thing, which is clearly what it is, and not something else, is actually some other thing, which it isn't. Stay in guard. The world is smaller than you think. Make your own weapon. Be careful with fire. Oh, fire is a type of hot spirit that dances about recklessly. It can warm you and provide life, but it will also singe your shell if it gets too close. Statues are meaningless. Don't think they are something. Ah, I'm just taking it too fast. Ah, nothing is harmless in the wars. Beware the jealousy of fathers. Do not steal the desires of others. If you lock something away, keep the key. Nothing should be locked away forever, so hold on to your keys. You will eventually return and unlock everything you hid away. I know a channel that now needs a Zod command so the audience can get a random person. That, that is a damn great idea. <laughs> That is a great idea. Bow to no one. There are those in this world who would impose their will on others. <laughs> Do not dream. Dreams are dangerous things. Yeah. Here we are. Obey all precepts. That's the last one. Most importantly, you must commit all of these precepts to memory and obey them all. Unfailingly, including this one. Hmm. Have you truly listened to everything I said? Let's start again and repeat the 57 percent of 57. Oof. Percept one. <laughs> Poor Breta, I have to listen to all bad things like over and over again. Okay. And see, gravity did not kill me. What? <laughs> Terrifying, beautiful, powerful, grey prince sword. This actually can fight.
Ah, uh, come on, give me time. Oh, we did not die. Does it count as death? Yeah, I, I guess it is. I guess it is. So there is like a lot of those guys, guys here. Uh, but yeah, let's see. We have one more place to put something here also. With bubble tea? That's good. Perhaps some sports. Maybe not tons of agony. Agony. Let's leave it. Ah, I ordered. It will be intense. Good. Good, nice. Mm, a long name, maybe. Because I'm feeling like I can't. It's really hard to jump with the uh, normal distance for me. I, I I can't time it properly. So if you have like longer nail, it's it's gonna it should be easier. Oh, gravity! This fight, yeah, trying to <laughs> trying to he's doing those jumps that are kind of mm, not what I expect from them. I mean, because whenever I want to. Can't from do attacks from above. I can't do from like the same ground because this this wave is going there. Uh, hmm. It's power shroom. I think it doesn't like, no need for that. Like really this time. Uh, where is it? Yeah, we are not on the bench. It's difficult, very spicy. Yeah. Uh, 
easy. But he's he's difficult, yeah. This out. This out. We have two more more points. We don't even have a time for healing ourselves there, to be honest. Maybe we should like uh, resign from this and resign from energy. Maybe. Yeah. More health points would be though. Lifeblood thing will be cool. Quick slashes. No, quick slashes not needed. Maybe, yeah. How's that working here? Like, okay, four more pop points. And if we go with this one instead, it's like. Two more health points. Okay, for one more notch. Okay, let's try that. Health we lost already. Oh, even more. That's not going to be cool. Kill me. Kill me already. Should 
kill me already. Challenging. At least I uh, for me because right. I'm just too slow for that guy. The other problem is actually sometimes I want to do jump attack, stop these jumps. and bars. It is challenging. It, this is a base game? Wow. If it's a base game, not DLC. I'm like... No, it's not working. Not working for my approaches. Um, huh. What about this one? But I need to, <laughs> yeah, the problem is I need to have full health. This is the first DLC. I think the fight is funny, but god, it is annoying. I mean, yeah, it, it's not a boring fight, no way. This is like a very fun to play fight. Uh, also challenging slash annoying slash frustrating slash die like 10 more times and rage quit treasure strength i know we have a lot of money but the problem is like going to the guy ah you said something about this Maybe we should leave it for later. Let's go here. You should. You, you said that I have to go for the tent with the fragile. Which one? This one? Maybe? It doesn't break in Dream Realm. Oh wow. Oh wow. Map updated. Which map? Anyway, uh, it doesn't break here. That's cool. Star Wars shell. It's kind of doing nothing, but I really feel like I'm losing health too fast if I don't have it. Because I'm like getting hit and getting hit and getting hit, and this actually kind of help us without getting hit. Uh, maybe long lane then. Quick slash nailing and a long nail. What else do we want here? Be quick focus for healing. Okay, let's try. Maybe I should start using like a spells also. Beautiful. 
Who's who's gonna die, die faster? in the stage 2 yeah, because he fell on his back so actually it works it works really well but I have some doubts about quick slash Because then we can have another three things like maybe quick focus. No. Papa nada. <sighs> Papa nada. Yeah, I know you don't have anything. Listen. Confederals home. Conifers at home. At last. But look at him. He's exhausted. He always does this. You will see Charles athletics. And collapses once he's done. He'll be sleeping for some time, I imagine. So even with him home, I'm still lost for company. Ah, but I do love the bug, even his faults. Seeing his passion for maps, it's something of an inspiration. Corny keeps asking me to join him on his adventures, and I've always declined. Maybe next time I should accept the offer. It is, right? It is. Awesome. And awesome. No, Marima. How? Now kill me. Sometimes I'm having feeling like uh he knows. He always knows, but right now, comparing to the previous one that he was doing other things, you know he's just jumping. Just jumping. <laughs> 